Hello everyone, you're probably trying to figure out how you can connect your Apple Pencil to your M2 iPad Pro. Now doing this is actually very basic and it really doesn't take too much time. The very first thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you see the side on your iPad 2 or your M2 iPad Pro that actually has the Apple Pencil. So essentially what this means is if you look to the right side of your iPad, essentially the same side where your volume buttons are, you're going to see this little circular little indent right there. Now this is for certain accessories, including your Apple Pencil. So what's great about this is that you can actually just kind of click your Apple Pencil 2 in this specific slot and it should end up working. So if I go and just set my iPad up like this, you'll see that I have my front camera right here and then I'll have the volume buttons here and I'll also have this portion right there. Now with your Apple Pencil 2, again, it has to be an Apple Pencil 2. The Apple Pencil 1 is not suitable for this iPad, so keep that in mind. What you want to do is you want to find the flat side of your Apple Pencil 2. Now the way I typically do this is I take the pencil tip, the pointy part that's pointing up, and it's facing the volume buttons. So then what I do is I go ahead and just pretty much slap this on top and it will automatically find exactly where the specific portion is that you need to set it up. And then you'll get this prompt on your iPad. But that is basically it. As you can see, now if it moves around a lot when you shake it around, then you probably didn't put it in right. And or if you don't get this prompt, then you probably didn't get it in right either. Now when you get this prompt, you just want to click continue and you can go ahead and you know utilize this iPad pencil, you know, however you want to. So now you can draw on it. I think there's going to be some issues or whatever. You want to go and just utilize it however you want to. And you can now use this Apple Pencil as you normally would as long as it's set up properly. So as you can see, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, but it looks like it's working now. And that is exactly how you do it. It's a very, very basic process. You can also swipe to the side here. You can also see your Apple Pencil battery life here too with this battery widget. So you can grab this widget and bring it to your Apple Pencil, you know, like your iPad home screen too. But that is pretty much how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.